Pick up an update for you on a story we've been following for more than a year now. Last March, 28-year-old Taylor Mermonski died in an accident when a train hit her car on Snowden Street. Since then, her mother and others in the community have been asking city leaders for increased safety measures at that crossing. Well, now it's finally happening. News 3 reporter Nana Cintio Bonsu tells us how it's helping a local mom get some closure. They're putting up my girl's crossing. They're putting up Taylor's crossing. The tears coming down Janine Romanski's face are tears of joy. We did it. We did it. Railroad cross arms and safety lights will be installed at the scene of her daughter's car accident. Taylor died in March of 2019 when a train hit her car late at night. There would have been crossing arms. <laughs> the accident never would have happened. Janine says the railroad crossing is unsafe. So at night, you can't see out here. When it is pitch black, it is. It's dangerous. After Taylor's death, the community rallied around the family and petitioned for safety measures at the tracks. I met her at city council. <laughs> Jennifer Schrader, who owns a business next to the railroad, started the petition. We have called and emailed and texted and asked and begged and pleaded. CSX crews were seen starting construction by the tracks Wednesday afternoon. He said that um, usually takes a month, month and a half. The transportation company tells News 3 that installation should be complete by the end of November. Neighbors who live in the area say this is long overdue. They've seen several accidents on these tracks that could have been prevented. At least three. I know it was a, uh, a tractor trailer truck that got hit on here a few years ago. I've seen trucks get stuck on the tracks. As she stands near Taylor's memorial, looking at the yellow cross, Janine hopes she's made her daughter proud. She would not let me rest if this happened to somebody else. She prays that Taylor is also resting and is at peace. I'm just sorry it took her dying to get this done. In Chesapeake, Nanacintio Bonsu, News 3. The city of Chesapeake says they've asked the CSX to expedite construction given the safety concerns. We'll be right back.